Yeah, just go for it right now. Here we go. Oh, don't do it. Yeah, yeah. Oh my god. What's happening, everyone? It's your man Chris, and I'm back again with another video. And um, you know, first things first, I do have to apologize for taking a month break. Um, a lot of things have been happening, man. I moved around like three times. Um, school started back up. Um, so I'm trying to get settled back in to the college life. Uh, also trying to, you know, get my art done when I can and also socialize with, you know, my other folks since, uh, you know, this is my last year in college. So I just want to make sure that, uh, that I'm, um, you know, getting my, uh, recommended amount of social activity <laughs> in, um, for this year, the social quota. But anyways, that aside, um, yeah, man, uh, I just want to get back on here and, you know, not leave you guys hanging because I know I, uh, the last thing I said I was going to do was uh, share some of my personal project stuff more, and um, I haven't been doing that. And I mean, the reason uh, is mainly because I, I just don't think it's at a point to show yet, you know? Um, I mean, these things take a long time, especially when it's, you know, done in the background um, of other things, and I'm doing it by myself, so it's not like I have any help. So um, it just takes a lot of time to get some of the stuff done. Um, but, you know, work is happening and, um, you know, I, I want to share some stuff fairly soon. But, you know, again, with the year starting with uh, this, this work study that I'm doing with school, um, it's going to be tough to like even pinpoint when I'll be able to start sharing some stuff with you guys. So really just bear with me, man. If you you know are a longtime fan, you know, I mean, I appreciate you for sticking around this long. Um, but yeah, man, um, <clears throat> I guess I could just call this a failing with style, honestly, because I mean, I, I might as well just make it one of those. <laughs> um, and, you know, in failing with style fashion, I have to, you know, address how I'm feeling, how everything's going. Um, and everything has been going really, really well for me, man. I cannot lie to you. Uh, a lot of things have been tipping in my favor. Finally, man, <laughs> um, it feels like, you know, last year I was getting kicked in the stomach. And it, was just, it just kept happening and happening and happening. And, um, I mean, it was hard work that I was going through last year. Um, a lot of sacrifices I made. But, you know, it all it, it's paying off right now, you know, with everything that's sort of opening up right now. And it's uh, it's, it's it's amazing, you know. <laughs> um, you know, life can just kind of, like, turn itself around or not even turn itself around with a little bit of hard work, and, you know, determination, um, how someone can sort of turn their outlook so to speak around because not everything is necessarily uh like changed for me like like not everything is like you know peaches and keen but um you know there there's definitely been some changes that i really am you know grateful for and uh again like so number one i have a car now i'm not sure if i yeah i don't think i had a car in my last upload <laughs> um but yeah now i have a car so you know being able to get around um is a lot more easy i can coordinate with I don't have to coordinate my fault. I don't have to coordinate with anybody to do stuff. Um, and if I really wanted to, I can, you know, hop on, hop in my car and then just go see my folks, you know, whenever I really want. Um, so that's, you know, really good. Um, I'm grateful for that. Um, <clears throat> school is uh, going pretty well. You know, I'm finally getting into these classes that, you know, really are going to start stretching my uh, skills and, you know, stretching my, uh, uh, my proficiency and like the stuff that I want to learn, whether it's conceptual art, 3D modeling, 3D sculpting, uh, game design, level design, and all of that video game stuff, um, you know, is really going to you know stretch me in that aspect, and I really am uh, excited, you know, because it's uh, it's a new opportunity to learn and grow, and um, I'm never I'm never gonna not take that opportunity to you know do that. So um, definitely, definitely, definitely excited for the new year as far as school goes um socially everything's been great um and for artists you know that's definitely like a, a sensitive more sensitive subject just because some of us you know like uh like to keep to ourselves and i definitely still am a, a, a more introverted introspective individual but i've definitely gotten out of my shell um and you know i have enjoyed you know just just talking to new folks you know just uh, getting you know new uh uh having you know new folks to talk to is always nice you know so um yeah man uh socially everything's been great so overall i've been doing pretty great man um everything has been going pretty well for me man um uh so art 
I forget how Phelan Styles go. I think I I show the art that I've been working on this week, but in this case, it'll probably be for like the past month. Um, which the majority of the stuff I can't show because it's it's stuff for the project. <laughs> but um, I, I can show a few things, probably meme art, you know, some some uh, serious pieces here and there, but probably just sketches for the most part. Um, yeah, man, my art. I mean, it's not like I've had a major improvement in the last month, two months. Um, and I mean. It, I've been drawing every day, but the amount has been a lot, lot. It's been significantly lower due to everything that I'm doing now. So I can't even say that. Uh, like sometimes I would draw for less than an hour a day, and you know that's that's very, very, very uh, abnormal for me because I went from drawing every day, multiple hours a day, um, this past summer, to barely getting you know 30, 40 minutes in, you know, which. It always sucks, you know, but since I know like this is going to be kind of one of the only times in my life where, well, I, I can't say for sure, but I know right now there's just a lot of things that I'm balancing to where it's like it makes sense for why I can't just sit down and do some of this stuff. Um, but I have enough time to make this video, so you know. <laughs> Anyways, let me chill. Um, I, I have some time today, I have some time this weekend, so I'm definitely going to get some work done. Um, but yeah, man, uh, overall, my drawing time is you know, significantly gone down and it's probably going to stay like that for the rest of the semester just because, uh, just the nature of like me being in college and in the last semester and everything being so intense. So, um, yeah, I mean, I, I can't even say I'll be on YouTube too often, um, because of that same reason, you know, so we'll see, you know, we'll play it by ear, but yeah, that's the situation with um, my art. So pro you probably saw some of my stuff scrolling through the screen or, you know, cycling through or whatever. Um, but yeah, man, uh, super duper uh, excited whenever I get a chance to draw. So I guess that's one of the benefits that, you know, whenever I draw, I'm excited about it. But um, anyways, yeah, uh, that aside, art that I've been inspired by. Um, <clears throat> I forget uh, the artist's name because there's multiple artists that worked on the Soul Calibur series. Um, but an artist I've really been, uh, you know, interested in. Um, is the artist for like Soul Calibur specifically for like the character designs for Soul Calibur 4 since that was the first Soul Calibur I really played um, I really enjoy like the the art that shows up like before um, you select the character um, and really Soul Calibur 5 really all of the Soul Caliburs have really nice art honestly the character designs always are very interesting to me and uh, you know like the art is just always on point man so I love that art style um, other styles that I like um I do not know I do not know man I have not I didn't really take the time within the last month two months to really dedicate to like looking for new styles that really pique my interest and it's not because I don't want to it's just uh, having that time and um you know again just different different day and age I'm living in now um but I'm gonna be on the lookout for sure for the next episode for sure so you know don't worry about that um but yeah, man, Soul Calibur 4 is definitely my favorite art style. You'll probably see the name of the artist um, on the screen somewhere. But yeah, man, definitely dope stuff. Um, <clears throat> I don't know what. Oh, yeah, story. So I, I can't I'm not talking about, you know, my project <laughs> specifically because um, I don't want, you know, anyone to really have any ideas about what it is quite, quite yet. I want to get a significant amount done before I even start, you know, promoting it or doing anything for it. Right. So, um, yeah, I'm kind of keeping that under the wraps right now, but you know, something's working in the background as always, man, I'm never not working in the background. So if, if, if I'm just silent, man, don't assume I'm just being lazy. Like I'm just not showing you stuff. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's uh, kind of the situation with, uh, with my story. And, um, let's see. The last thing is, uh, I guess I could just say future plans. I'm not sure if that's an actual segment in Failing with Styles. I forget. But, um, yeah, man, future plans. Um, oh, no, 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 no. Okay, before, scratch that. Scratch that. Next section uh, video games that I've been playing and video games that I'm inspired by. That's right. What am I thinking? Um, right now I'm playing Xenoblade. <clears throat> and, you know, I think the experience of playing Xenoblade is heightened by the fact that I kind of was exposed to the memes prematurely. Like, I was exposed to a lot of the Xenoblade fan base before I even really started playing Xenoblade. Um, like, I, I was aware of a lot of the memes. Like, I couldn't put names to faces or anything like that, but, like, I just knew certain things. I knew, like, you know, sometimes the dubbing, it could be funny or, you know, like, uh, the character models could just 
gotta do something dank like it it's stuff like you know, like edits you know all of that stuff ytps i've seen a lot of that stuff but um yeah man i mean xenoblade is, is it's really good i actually used to have the game on my 3ds like back in man, i want to say like 2016 2017 um but yeah, man, I didn't like it when I back then, and I was on bath salts or something. I don't know why I didn't like it. Um, but I started playing it again because a friend let me borrow it, and um, yeah, man, I'm having a really nice time with it. Um, let's see where am I at? I just met Riki, and uh, we just fought that dragon. So if you if you know uh, you know anything about Xenoblade, then you know where I'm at now. I don't know if I'm halfway or not yet, but you know, I'm on chapter seven, probably about to be eight soon. So. Yeah, man, we'll see. But, um, yeah, I'm enjoying the game so far. Uh, I will give you more updates as I, uh, progress. Uh, assuming that, you know, I remember. <laughs> but, um, yeah, now for future plans. Um, yeah, man, uh, just getting through school. Getting through school, getting through, uh, college. Um, developing my portfolio. Uh, growing as a person. That's always the goal. That's always, uh, you know, what it all comes down to. Like, just growing uh you know internally and uh you know making sure that your mental health is you know always straight i've always been a big proponent of that um one of the things i've been doing to uh help myself is you know going to the gym every day or not every day but like um keeping my body in shape so doing something active every day um which usually means going to the gym but can sometimes just mean going on a jog um but doing something to get the blood pumping it really helps with uh just I don't know, man. Keeping your your mind like your mind is just uh you know. There's so much stuff that bogs your mind down that like you could just release when you're going on like a run, or you're lifting heavy weights. Um, so I've been doing that and it's been really helping me. Just keep a level head and um you know really it really helped my focus and you know everything. It just it feels nice to like just you know work out and exhaust yourself in the morning so that you know like your body is like put in like almost like a numb kind of a state and like i don't know about you guys but like feeling that like you worked hard before you go and like you know actually do like educational things or like uh you know work related things it feels better like 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 when you're at work like you feel more alive i don't know what it is or you're at your job or you're at you know school you feel just more alive more aware but that could just be me being a weirdo i don't know but anyways um yeah man so just keeping that in line and you know overall just just uh, maintaining my health man uh maintaining my health and uh um yeah man just just being being a good person <laughs> which you know that's that's just so that's so cringe but you know like it's not cringe being a good person but you know everybody wants to say that they want to be a good person it's like you know I, I i gotta actually start you know doing stuff that all right i'm done so anyways man um yeah this was the failing with style again off the cusp very random don't know what the next video will be when it will be so you know if you want to unsub you know please be my guest man uh, that is you know never really bothered me because it's like this channel has always just been about you know how i feel in a moment anyways um so i'm not gonna sit here and you know beg for followers beg for you to like the video although if you want to that'd be cool um yeah i'm not gonna do all of that man but you know i do want to hear what you guys uh have been up to since i've been away since i have been away for so long um, or what feels like so long since, you know, on YouTube, you know, if you don't post in a month, you're basically irrelevant, which I'm, I already am irrelevant, but it's like, you know, um, even more so. So yeah, man, uh, let me know what you guys have been up to, what projects you've been working on. I know I've been secretive with mine, but you know, that, that doesn't mean you have to be with yours, you know, um, <laughs> and just, you know, just, just chop it up with me, man, in the comments. Uh, but anyways, man, again, hope you guys are doing well. Um, Thanks for, you know, listening to this video. And again, it has been your man, Chris, and I am out. Peace.